Hey guys, this is Chris Collects Things back again, and I have a special guest, returning special guest, I should say, Ryan over at Game Essays. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I'm excited for these mystery packs. Yep. Uh, quick backstory. I went to my local Walgreens, and apparently it was the right time because of the Tower of Power was there, and I was able to cop uh, five of these bad boys, so... We're going to open them and we're going to see what type of vintage or steam siege we pull. <laughs> <laughs> Let's so, hope for the best. So, yeah, if we look at these, like you, these have a one in five chance as opposed to the uh, Walmart ones that I think had a one in four chance, if I remember correctly. You get mm -hmm. one booster pack, one foil card, and an online code card. And then on the back. Yeah. Looking for the vintage pack. So for these, what they're considering vintage is platinum, heart gold, and soul silver, or black and white. Yeah, which any of those would be great to get because they are not easy to find. And I've even seen some decent, um, you know, seeing other openings, some decent cards, even out, like with that extra card you get, some like GXs and stuff. So um, there's even a chance to get a decent pull out of there. But yeah, I feel like... From what I've seen, the packs, most of the time, aside from Steam Siege being a potential possibility, are usually pretty solid. Yeah, so, should we, shall we? Yeah, we go shall. for oh, it. Man. It's all you. This is, is nerve-wracking. <laughs> <laughs> all right. What's behind door number one? What's behind door number one? It is a sun and moon burning shadow. <laughs> Not, I, I not mean, the not, worst. not the worst compared to the Walmart ones. I feel like you can usually do a little bit better. So burning shadows is, you know, Hey, it's solid. And the, the card is our detective Pikachu Mewtwo here. It looks like, oh. uh, I don't, I wonder if these were made by the same people with the same logo, MJ holding company. Yeah, I, I, I believe so. Yeah. But yes, it is MJ Holding. Yeah, I, and they, I think they're the same people that made the Mystery Power Cube, too, to be honest with you. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, so yeah, our code card was an, a Flygon EX box for those at wow. home. All right. No idea what that set is. <laughs> nope, me neither. All right, next one. <sighs> Will we get something vintage-y? Hoping for the best. I know. Ooh. What do Not we got? vintage -y, but we have a Sun and Moon Unbroken Bonds pack. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, That's see, I think most pack. of the time, even if you don't get a vintage pack, most of the time you're doing all right with something like Unbroken Bonds. And for the car, it's like we have a Steam Siege uh, Bishar. It may be a shiny Bisharp, I'm not sure. Is it blue uh, shiny? I think it is. Yeah. I feel like I might have this card, but I do like the uh duality, like the the dark and the sorry, darkness and the steel energy, like the two types. I think that's something that's in Steam Siege. I don't know if that's a Steam Siege yeah. exclusive, but it's pretty cool. I've only I don't know if they did it in more, but that's the only one I've seen it in. But yeah, it is uh, Steam Siege gets a lot of crap, but it does have, it just has some like shinies that you just kind of get and you're like, oh, I guess that's a shiny. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, again, another Flygon EX box. So they must have had a plentiful amount of those. <laughs> All right, door number three, mystery pack. What can we get? Oh, what do you think it is? Oh, is it? More burning uh, shadows. Okay. <laughs> Still not, you know, not the worst. Uh, if you get a rainbow rare Charizard, that's, I think you'll be okay with that's it. That's true. But this is a sick card here. A Mewtwo GX. It is a promo card, but hey, I mean, I'll take it. It's one of the one of the better promos to get. It it might be a Detective Pikachu promo because it looks like more realistic. I don't know. Do you know? Uh, not off the top of my head, no. But it's it's definitely possible to kind of like 
they're all kind of numbered around probably it might be like numbered around when the detective pikachu set came out it's definitely possible we have a a legacy evolution pin collection for the code card so we're down to nice. the final two getting a little worried hey, here the uh, the odds should be in your favor to, to at least get something interesting one in five Ooh. Oh, do we got burning something? shadows what do you think more burning shadows <laughs> nope it is my second shining legends oh nice rayquaza artwork so that is a good that's a good wow. find right there this this nice this one pack is probably worth all of the five that i bought <laughs> I yeah, like eight I or mean nine that. Dollars a, a box. Yeah, so there. Yeah, Shining Legends is about a fifty dollar pack at this point. Yeah, so again, so. keeping the seal probably. <laughs> Maybe I'll awesome. open one eventually. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah, it's tough. I mean, that's a shiny Rayquaza. Like, this is a bit of a cop out, though. A common fletchling reverse hollow. <laughs> yeah. So they give you so nice good pack. So this made it worth it. Yes. That made it worth it. Yes. So I feel like no matter what, you're a happy camper. Yes. I'm. I'm, I'm very happy. I know. Maybe my reaction didn't seem that happy. It's more shock. So I was, I was <laughs> expecting more burning shadows. Um, collector's chest, spring 2017. Everyone, <laughs> that's the good. <case, laughs> All right. So down to the last one. After this, though, maybe we'll open some of those packs. What do you say? Go for it. You down for that? Oops. As yeah, I definitely. Hit my camera. <laughs> and what is this? <laughs> is that cosmic? No, it would be. Oh. It wouldn't be fitting if I ended with a burning shadow. <laughs> <laughs> Still, hey, more chances but, for the Zard. But the odds. One, one out of five, I said, right? Yeah, that's exactly what happened. That's exactly what happened. So you can't really complain about that when the odds are... You exactly didn't get what... Steam Siege. Right. You didn't get Steam oh, Siege. Oh, I'm happy about that. Yeah. And Trust me, oh, I've opened some and I... Oh, wow. Is that Evolutions? This is an... Ev- or what is that? It's actually a Flash... Uh, XY Flash Fire. I believe this is Flash uh, Fire. I think so. Wow. But this is such a, we, okay. pulled, we pulled a Zard. Wow. Okay, I did not expect. I that. didn't either. That's we pulled the Zard. <laughs> and oh, I... No way. <sighs> <laughs> uh, let me let me look this bad boy up. I'm pretty sure it's Flash Fire. I can recognize that symbol. Yes. I... Yes, it is. I don't know a lot. Oh, but... not bad. Not bad. But I I had like a Bulbapedia of like all the sets like when I was organizing my binder and stuff and I distinctly remember that logo. Um Shiny Requaza EX box though. That's a pretty good box I would think. Yeah. For the code card. So, hey, I mean, so that's like a obviously it's not the most desirable Charizard, but that's still a $10 Charizard. It's not even like a full art or anything. So, that's really solid. We'll sleeve this bad boy real quick. Yeah, how is the back looking? Maybe a little uh, uh, centering's off. This is more than this, yeah. but whatever. Yeah, it's a charity. It's still, yeah, it's more of a it's more of a binder kind of card anyway. So, Definitely. but a very nice one to have for sure because flash fire is not easy to find. So, well, we have some burning shadows to open. The Unbroken Bonds, would you open or what do you think um, about this? It's up to... Unbroken it's it's starting to get to that territory where you might want to leave it sealed, but if you want to open it, I don't think there's anything wrong with opening it. I think we're gonna open it. I'm I like like I said, I have I've already opened a few of these Walgreens packs and I'm pr- I got I did get an unbroken bonds and I'm probably gonna open mine. All right. You gotta go for the, the Reds challenge, man. Yeah. Sold. All right. <laughs> you you can see everything so good here? Yep. All right. Burning Shadows, number one. Obviously, Shining Legends, we're not opening. <clears throat> yeah. 
as, as I lost you on the camera there for a second. Yeah, well, I can, I can still hear. Don't worry. All right. Well, we got a green code card here, so not very good. <laughs> Four for sun and moon. And I'm, I'm feeling like we're going to pull some grass. It's actually fire. Olivia. Right. Kiowi. That's, I definitely butchered that name. Porygon Dose. Sandy Gast. More Lulls. A Crab Brawler. Stuffle. Inke. A Reverse Pan Pour. And a Alolan mm. Radicate. Non holographic. Yeah. Next pack. All right, not not the best pack, no. but you know, I actually probably don't even have that card. I think. I don't. Ever, I seem to get like the same two rares from Burning Shadows. So. Yeah, I must have not opened much because those don't look familiar at all to me. Yeah. Well, here's your boy Crow Gunk. Oh yeah. Another green pack. Oh. <laughs> That's the luck sometimes. <laughs> it's it's a tough set to get anything from water, but. Escape Rope, Sophocles, Ribombi, is your boy Crow Gunk. <laughs> That's a good one. Meow. It's a beautiful meow. Yeah, it's in like Sutopolis or whatever, I think. <laughs> I don't know, that's what it looks like. Wimpod, Tegaderm, Togedamaru, <laughs> and then that <laughs> Electro. I actually do have that card, I think. And Azumarill. Not hollow. So far, nothing great. We have one left. I know. I want to at least see a white code card. I'll take it for the unbroken bonds, at least. All right. There's one. Nice. We got here. If you get the rainbow zard, man. <laughs> It'll all be worth it. It already is. Although, but fire. Yeah. We're pulling fire. Or electricity. Plumeria, Cedra, Rotom Dex, Sandy Gast, Venipede, Horsey, Mud Bray Wyatt, Follow the Buzzards, <laughs> Lediba, uh, Reverse Araquinid, non, uh, I'll say non holographic, it's reverse, it's a rare, and a Salazzle GX. Uh, not bad. I will take yeah. it. I was gonna say full art, but it's number twenty-five. Yeah. So, yeah, that is the regular GX, but still, yeah. Good. I don't have this card, so I will take it. I think I actually do have the full art of this card, but I don't think I have the regular GX. But probably sleeve that bad. Solid. Boy. Yeah. And unbroken bonds. Last but not least. How many bronze? Can, yeah. How many bonds can we break? <laughs> I think it's worth opening no matter what. Even if like it's still a fun set. Like even if you don't get a hit, like it's you know you don't get to open too many of these lately. So yeah, I don't know if I've opened any or one. I think it was the uh, oh, it's a green code card. Unfortunately, oh. that's a bummer. Yeah, I don't know if there's anything like cool you could still get in the reverse slot, but you never know. We'll see. A Beast Bringer, Hitsmon Top, Gliscor, Riolu, Porygon, Inke, Caterpie, Clefairy, Reverse Porygon, and the Grinchly Killer, Incineroar. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I see Incineroar all the time now. <laughs> yeah. But now you got an unbroken bonds incineroar. <laughs> yeah, that's true, and I get the sweet pack art at least, so for my binder yeah. collection. But true, this, this, and and this are our best two pulls, I believe. Oh yeah, of the day, big time. So yeah, so verdict. I think it's worth it if you get five at least. You test your odds. If you can get a shining legends about around fifty dollars, I'd say that these are worth it what would you say oh absolutely like i said i've opened a few and i have gotten a lot of steve siege but i did also pull a shining legends pack so yeah 
you can't go wrong most of the time even if you don't get the chase pack you get like a, a cosmic eclipse or unbroken bonds or burning shadows which are all pretty good to get um so it's it's really a, one of the better mystery packs i've seen yeah same here uh, i think it's pretty on par with the uh walmart box that i opened as well yeah yeah and you don't have to worry about detective pikachu in this one so <laughs> that's true well actually you do because mute mewtwo made his appearance. yeah that's true <laughs> yeah. freak show mewtwo made his appearance <laughs> <laughs> all right well thanks thanks for joining me on this video um we had a good time uh Hopefully I'll see you back in the future and maybe we can do Definitely. some in-person battles, which will make the logistics a little easier anyways. Looking forward to it. All right. So anyways, guys, if you, if you like this content, please like, subscribe. Let's let's get to 10 likes. We're not talking 10K. We're just talking 10. We can do that. We just, hit, we just reached 25 subs. So let's keep that count going. So 100, again, special vintage opening. So... Please subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you next time.